in this video i'm going to teach you how to go from this to this and here are the supplies you'll need um the smooth and shine curl gel a paddle brush a comb and a water bottle so this is me getting up first thing in the morning taking my bonnet off and we all know ladies when we take our bonnet off our hair looks a mess like the curls they don't stay i don't know why they just don't stay it looks a mess so let's get it right so what i'm going to do first is comb it out and I'm using a wide tooth comb. You can use a paddle brush at this step. I just forgot my paddle brush um, um, in my car and I didn't feel like going to get it. So I'm just combing it out with my wide tooth comb. But typically I do also use a paddle brush. Spray it down with water after you comb a few knots out. Um, make sure you use a towel because you'll get yourself wet if not. And I'm just going to spray it down all the way through thoroughly. Don't be afraid to use a lot of water, guys. It's water, it'll dry. It's gonna help you comb through easier and it makes the hair look better. So use as much as you can or, you know, don't be afraid to use it. Wrap yourself with a towel and just use, um, you know, to your discretion, I use a lot of water. Especially in the back where the hair is the thickest at. So now I'm gonna comb back through it again, now that I've added the water. And as you can see, it's already starting to look better. And again, at this step, I would typically be using my paddle brush at this point, but I don't have it on me. So make sure you use your paddle brush. And this is a closure. So if you have a closure, just hold it down a little because you don't want to put too much tension on the closure and your edges. It's already sewn in tight, so I don't want to pull on the closure and my edges. And just continue to comb it through. I'm adding a little more water in a spot that I missed in the back. The back is the hair. You know, the hair in the back is really, really thick. So here's the gel. This is the um, smooth and shine gel that I'm going to use. It's really thick. This is what it looks like. So just use a little bit. Smooth it out on your hands. And then just massage it through with your fingertips and your hair um, all the way through the front, the back, the sides, everywhere, all the way around. After you massage it through, you're just gonna scrunch your hair up like this. Take your fingers and just scrunch it up. This is gonna define the curls. So you need more than just water. This is gonna define the curls and give it a, you know, that curl pattern back. This is a water wave hair and it's gonna give it that curl pattern back. So scrunch it up. That's the trick to this, guys. Once you put it on, scrunch your hair up and do that all the way around. And if you need to add more water, feel free to do so because this gel is thick. So I don't want my hair to look too weighed down, so I'm adding more water. And I'm just gonna continue to scrunch it up all the way around, add more gel if needed. And then this is how it came out. I love it, as you can see, it's pretty. I love these curls. It just looks amazing. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.